Hi friends, my name is Rachel. Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, please go ahead and subscribe and don't forget to turn on that button so that you never miss a new video on your journey. Today's workout is going to be a meditation slash yoga routine. It's going to be a simple one and it's uh, basically a beginner's meditation yoga routine. We're just going to make sure we connect, we reconnect with our inner selves. We're going to make sure we just touch ourselves and get ourselves to a point of relaxation, a point of releasing any stress and tensions in your body. And you don't need to be an expert at yoga or anything. Just make sure you calm yourself down and recollect yourself and be in that state that makes you feel the most peaceful. So with this workout, we're going to begin by just warming up. Warming up, you can do anything to warm up as long as you don't hurt yourself. I always tell people, warm up but don't hurt yourself. Just to get your muscles to be ready for the workout ahead. Yes, you can do anything. You can do uh, neck, neck stretches and uh, twists are very good at releasing tensions. So let's get started. We're going to start by just twisting in circles our head. And in that, we are twisting our neck muscles. Be able to start and to be able to give your body a full body uh, twist you can also go twist ahead with your waist like that and you can change direction while you're twisting your neck muscles In this warming up, you're just gonna stretch your entire body muscles. In whatever you do, you have to be patient with yourself. Take it slow. Because the purpose of this routine is to relax, meditate and recollect yourself, and get back, and get back your inner peace that we all desire. take long warming up because most of the work is going to be in a real routine so you're going to just get down and you're going to lay it down vertically on your yoga mat hands straight feet straight I'm not entirely on the mat and once you've found your point of comfort you're going to relax and once you're on your mat and relaxed, make sure your tensions are all released and at this point think about the most peaceful place in the world. It may be imaginable, it may be real, as long as it gives you peace or the feeling of peace when you think about it. And then relax, inhale, Perform deep in and out, inhale and exhale exercises. And when you inhale and exhale, please inhale through your nose and release through your mouth.
gonna bring your right leg up, fold it, but do not rest on the ground. Hold it in that position. And you're gonna lift your left leg as well. Fold it in position. Call that position for a while and make sure that push them a little bit back as if you're bringing them to your chest but not entirely. is straight on the ground. You should not have any space between your butt and your back or your table. And once you're there, you're gonna squeeze your shoulders up. And once you're done with that, you're gonna lie on the side, on your right side, and you're gonna use your elbow to anchor yourself onto the mat. And you're gonna, for support, you could get your hand, support your head, so that you can be a little bit more comfortable. And with this hand, you're gonna lift, you're gonna use that hand to plant it on the ground. When you lift your legs all together, your legs should be touching each other like that. And you're gonna try to lift your legs up as far as you can. Be mindful of your muscles here because they tend to want to squish up. So if you're not used to it, it could be painful. But if you're really used to it, then it should be, shouldn't be a problem. So stretch your legs together like that. Lift them up. You could even hold here to just be monitoring your muscles, how they're doing. And push your abdominals in. Push your abdominal muscles in, and once you're doing that, try to get a point of balance because if you're not used to it, you tend to want to wobble front or wobble backwards. So find a place of balance, lift your legs up, and relax like that. You could plant this hand for support down, you could hold here, whatever you like, whatever is easier. So lift your legs up and relax there while pushing in your stomach muscles and holding them tight. If you're okay with this, you could just leave your head to be free. 
body performing this exercise. Hold that position for some time. And once you're done, we're going to turn on the side, the opposite side, and the left side. Legs straight.
it could be imaginary, it could be real. Think about the most beautiful thing you've ever seen. It could be a water fountain, it could be a beautiful country, it could be a beautiful forest, full of bad sounds, all those beautiful things that you can give us. Touch the ground, crawl to 
to the front a little bit and you lift your toes up standing on your big toe you're gonna hold the position for some time and keep back down roll back and lift yourself up fold your butt or I mean fold your back muscles tucking in your stomach muscles and folding in your back of your spine and then relax see that? we're gonna do the same tuck in your stomach muscles and relax you see that? so we're gonna do this with the hands touching the ground and with the toes on points like that or our heels lift that breathe in relax close again and relax on toes again and relax Close again and relax. Hands back on the front. Crawl to the front. Put your knees, your feet apart while you're on the mat, and you are going to rock front and back. That, but taking these movements as slow as possible, you want to take your time to be able to feel every movement and walk every muscle.
You support in that position. Make sure that your straight leg is pulsing up and down. So make very small pulses. It will make you feel comfortable. in your neck, a crop in your neck.
once you're done, put on your feet. And relax. With your legs apart, you're gonna lift your hands up and let them touch each other on the other side, stretching out your grip side and hold the position for some time. Don't forget to breathe in and out. And once you're done with that, you're gonna change positions to opposite leg and you're gonna lift your hands up to the other side and give your right side a good nice stretch. wide apart the length of your mat look up and you're gonna try to drop backwards giving your abdominal muscles a good nice stretch relax there back to the front drop your head down tuck in the thorax muscles you're gonna get down onto your yoga mat make sure you hold that position and you're gonna bring your hands up while you do that position you're gonna relax right there if you can think about the most peaceful place in this world or the happiest place you want to be relax and meditate right there Thank you. 
your legs up, 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 up into a forward position like that. And you're gonna get your hands and press it your ankles into the position. Chest up. Drop your leg, your head backwards and hold that position. Bring your hands to the front and to the floor. And your palms touching each other like that. Bring them to the floor. Breathe in. Tuck in your stomach muscles. And bring your, try to bring your head to the front. Just where the can and hold that position. You're done. Get back up slowly and relax. You get down on the mat again. And then you're gonna make sure you drop one leg and the other leg crosses over the other. And you're just gonna find a comfort position. Just relax, you don't need to do so much work, just relax, don't strain so hard, just relax. Don't forget to breathe in and out. Your face, the better. 
But if you're still struggling to get flexible like me, then the father you are is good enough. Like that. 
Once you're done, slowly get back up. Never always rush getting back up because it could hurt yourself. Hi guys. Did you enjoy this meditation workout? I hope you did. Please leave me a comment in the comment section below. And please like the video, of course. Share the video with friends if you can. And if you haven't subscribed, please don't leave without subscribing. And I hope to see you again in the next routine.